heartiest greetings and fel felicitations to one and all of you on the occasion of India's Independence Day. I would like to extend a very warm welcome to all of you here this morning for the flag hoisting ceremony to mark the 66th Independence Day of the Republic of India. As you are aware, India-Oman relations are historical. From the traditional maritime links, these have come a long way and are today in the nature of a strategic partnership. The exceptionally close India-Oman relations are multifaceted. They cover a broad range of activities and fields, economic, commercial, cultural, and people-to-people -people contacts. And in that, I think the role of the Indian community in Oman is a very important component. I would like on this occasion to once again acknowledge your contribution and to congratulate one and all of you on the occasion of India's Independence Day. As is customary, I will read the address to the nation delivered by the Honorable President of India, Sri Pranam Mukherjee, on the eve of Independence Day that was last evening. The President's address to the nation reads as follows. My fellow citizens, it is a great privilege to address for the first time my fellow Indians living within our country and in a hundred corners across the globe on the 65th anniversary of our independence. Words cannot adequately express my gratitude to the people and their representatives for the honor of this high office, even as I am deeply conscious of the fact that the highest honor in our democracy does not lie in any office, but, is being, but in being a citizen of India, our motherland. Final call to victory, Jai Hind, was given by Subhash Chandra Bose, fondly known to every Indian as Netaji. Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru, Baba Sahib Ambedkar, Sardar Vallabhai Patel, Maulana Abul Kalam Azad, Sadojni Naidu, and many others charted the roadmap of independent India. My fellow citizens, if there is one man in history whose name is synonymous with peace, then it is Gandhiji, the architect of our independence. My fellow citizens, let us leave behind the way of hatred, violence, and anger. Let us put aside our petty quarrels and factions. Let us work together for our nation with the devotion of a child towards a mother. Let may God protect us, may God nourish us, may we work together with vigor and energy, may our studies be brilliant, may there be no hostility amongst us, may there be peace, peace, peace. Peace must be our ideology, progress our horizon. Jai Hind.